Hello folks and welcome to Max Thrust RC and the Big Ears Rocketry launch event. It's one of the uh, biggest events on the UK rocketry calendar. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. There's going to be some great stuff going off, uh, all sorts of things happening. So I hope you enjoy the show. Let's cut to the action. I was looking at the I am pointing in the direction. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> so what, should we try and go get the cone then, or? How far out is it? It's not all that far. We'll give it a go. Yeah, good luck in that field. So Ben, this is your uh, rocket. It's a cluster of three, yeah? Yes, three H226 skid marks. So um, they're the six grain XL, biggest skid marks we can get out of the place. Absolutely fantastic. So here's the rocket, folks. As you can see, it's pretty sizable. What diameter is that? Oh, uh, it's seven and a half. It's lock, lock seven and a half inch tubing, so it's fairly lightweight, but... Yeah. Excellent. Well, it's sure to look absolutely fantastic going off the pad. And we've just got one big shoot this time. Yeah, it's got an eight-foot rocket man shoot in there, so um, yeah, no in a deployment bag. So hopefully a lot, lot simpler than the last big one I did. Fantastic! Can't wait to see that go up. There she is. Actually, yeah, we can actually see <laughs> uh, Ben Jarvis flying his crack-built rocket Sun Profanity. <laughs> He's got three H226 skid marks. It's got lots of stability. 
and it's got a multiple uh, motor exit with an electrical parachute. And we're clear to go in. Five, four, three, two, one. Bye -bye. For a second there, I thought the parachute didn't. <laughs> the parachute fell out. That's a square chute. It didn't separate. It's split. It's a four cup. Yeah. Um, okay. Rock <laughs> shape. Look, you see, you think it's a yeah, because yes, that's a strong wind, but it's coming down quite straight, isn't it? Yes, yeah. Our camera's died. It's not doing. Huh? Oh, is it? Oh, well, oh what, your no, I want your GoPro. I watched it go up. Yeah. I'll please like that. Thank you, Oh, I don't know, Ben. Are <laughs> oh, you be over? He's going to just move over. He's going, over. Just, just yeah, he's going over. Yeah, he's going over. tree. That might. Oh, that thing. Yeah, that tree. No, other side of the tree. Other side of the tree. That's good. <laughs> right. Longburn might have been better for it. Probably yeah. down the slides. Yeah. Yeah. The, yeah. The big shoot. Yeah. It, it's just so much drag. The big know. anchor out there. Yeah. 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 It's, <laughs> for a speed though, you really get to reboot. Just keep an eye on it, please. Okay. And we are clear to go in five, four, three, two, one, four. Yeah. 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 Try and keep turning them out. Okay. I'm running out of material. That's all right. All right. The things I keep saying are quite corny, aren't they? I'm trying. I'm trying hard. You're trying. Trying. And we are going in five. Four, three, two, one. Very nice, lovely. That was very helpful. It's supposed to be going out slowly every go. That's not structural. I mean, that's just to keep the outside firm. Oh, did you not take a video? Yes, yes. What's his name? Monty. 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 And he's um, 
Doesn't fit. Gonna be an astronaut, is he? No, he's got his own face. Look at that. He just got launched like that. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Nose cone hanging free. <laughs> But then we'll do the parachute. It's going on a skid mark. We launch it like this. A skid mark? Yeah. Oh, at least it's going to look good going up. Yeah, it's a four grain skid mark. H. Did Monty live? Oh uh, well, I've got some good news. Oh. No, I've got some bad news. Oh. How did the man? Right. 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 Can we have one? I'll put it in the big. Yeah, fair enough. Alright. Yeah. Lawrence, stop recording. Somebody play some sad music, quick. I've got some good news, lads. I've got some bad news, lads. Good news is my rocket landed intact. No damage. Monty survived intact. The bad news is I've got wet trousers. Oh, <laughs> oh no, the greatest of tragedies. This none of it was worth it. I get on So he thought he'd fly feet. over 150 feet. Just uh, uh, spook any cows. I think he was trying to scoop them up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and scatter them in all different directions. <laughs> So mate, it's, it's that time again, isn't it? Phantom blue time. Phantom blue time. Yeah, it's going up. Except for we've made a mod, haven't we? I don't know if you can briefly take the nose cone off to show people what, uh, yes, what we've done. Um, because it's a little bit windy, I don't know how easy we see. So we've just stuffed a massive long red streamer in instead of a parachute. And it's going to land nicely in all these uh, rapeseed crops anyway. It doesn't really need a parachute. Yeah, and then now go and get it. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we're going to have lots of helpers to find it as well. <laughs> and then the idea is that that long stream, well, it's about two metres worth, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's about two metres of that stream. That's going to sit on um, on top of the rapeseed and we should be able to find it. Because as we know, Phantom Blue is the most reliable rocket in the world. It is. So we're going to go prove that now. What are you flying on? C C67. C67. Old reliable. Yeah. Awesome. Let's see it go. On the model pad, we've got David de Crema and Natalia flying Phantom Blue on the C67, and this is an old reliable rocket. So we want to make sure we get it back, and we're going to launch in five, four, three, two, one, launch. Wow. Gone. <laughs> Another beautiful flight. <laughs> Still never failed. It's just perfect, isn't it? Every the, time. The streamer worked really well actually, I was really pleased with that because um, I think on today, had it had that parachute in, it would have ended up about a mile that way. <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you know what? Actually, should have bought some of those uh, D motors for it. Yeah. <laughs> that would have been awesome, especially with the streamer. Wicked, mate. Well yeah. done. <laughs> Down there somewhere. Where the cross area is. That's going pretty straight. 
I'm going to get running. Stay away from the trees. <laughs> right, I'm going to get running after it. Let's see. Can't be bothered to stand up. Can we have heads up in the car park, please? Just in case. Oh, you're going to put the clock in there. That's good. Heads idea. up. Heads up. Yeah. Maybe I'll leave mine for a bit. Just quick changes. Yeah, heads up in the bottom end of the car park. In the trees, I think. Oh, oh no! It's coming back. It's coming back. It's, coming back. it's in. The, it's in the trees. What do you must do? So, buddy, uh, maiden flight there of Ukrainian blue, and how would yeah. you describe it? Excellent. It like, was epic. Wasn't beyond it? my expectations, actually. <laughs> uh, it was. It, the only slight kink was that it landed in some trees, but it wasn't high enough to, for that to be a problem. So, uh, yeah, really, really, really pleased. Yeah, you got, it was so straight as well. Yeah, straight like an arrow. See, uh, we'll see how Nat did on the old camera work. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that was absolutely awesome, buddy. Really, really good. So, the level one next then. It's proven in itself, and then uh, yeah, the level one now is achievable. I think. Sweet, awesome. Really well, we'll be back for that. <laughs> Don't play with the walkie-talkie, otherwise you'll start talking to everybody. You're going to look after it for me.
I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Are you uh, a scouter? Oh my god. Mm -hmm. So you're, you're totally out of country. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. 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 I'm going through all of my list of names. I think Jen, 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 Right, Tony, can you the with his pterodactyl, 5.5 inch, uh, going on a J280, uh, Smoky Sam, predicted altitude is 2,000 feet, recovery by parachute. Smoky. There we go, folks. So we had a successful ejection charge go off, but it, um, for whatever reason, didn't deploy. And uh, and there she is. Such a shame. It's a beautiful looking rocket. But you say you've repaired her once before? Yeah, repaired it once. So. Uh, yeah, it shredded down, it crashed down to the. In capable the fins. hands, it'll be back <laughs> in the sky again. Bits of it might. <laughs> Fantastic. The fins might surface again. Boom. Boom. Okay, folks, so that just about wraps it up for today. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. And if you're interested in getting involved, we really do want to expand this hobby in the UK, bring it to the masses. I've put a link to the UCRA website, that's the United Kingdom Rocketry Association, at the bottom of your screen now. There's also a link in the description uh, so you can check out all of the clubs around the place. Ears, Midland, there's all sorts to choose from. So uh, visit the club page there and you're sure to find your closest club. It'd be brilliant to see you at a launch event in the UK at some time. Well, that's all from Max Thrust RC for now and I'll be sure to see you next time. Thank you very much for watching.